And you got me a verbal warning at work. Did I? Mm. What for? Um, do you remember when we did Nando, <laughs> Nando's New Comedian of the Year? Oh, I remember. <laughs> <laughs> we did the big ones. I had to stay over because there weren't enough room in the car for me, apparently. So I had to stay over. And I had work at one the next afternoon. I went out and got fucking absolutely wankered, lad. Like blackout drunk. And um It's not like you. <laughs> <laughs> the morning after I'm like that foot this stranging work said oh, I'm fucking not well and that. You had to leave early to get to Southport for a gig though. So <laughs> I went, nah mate, I weren't, I weren't even well on school. I, I weren't even well on stage. I mean, I didn't even play, so, you know, something's out of sorts. When <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking pay for another room for the night. Stayed in, and the fire alarm went off. Oh. Smoke alarms and everything. Everyone's having to get evacuated. I just stayed in. I was like, if it's my time to go, it's my time to go. That's how fucking That's a beautiful way was. to think. And then um, went in work a couple of days later, got a verbal warning. All because of you. I don't think you can blame me for that. <laughs> 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 fucking fire alarm's going off because you're gaslighting, mate. 